Welcome back to Tada 3D Printing. Today I will be reviewing the Bamboo Labs X1 Carbon with AMS printer and explaining why it's now one of my favorite printers. So let's get into it. At first I was hesitant to do a review of this printer because it's not a new printer. It's been out for a while, but I have had it for about a year now and I've really enjoyed using it. And so I really wanted to show you guys some of the things that I do like and a few things that I do not like. The first thing that I like about the Bamboo X1C is that it is in stock. No pre-orders, no waiting. It says that it ships out in one to three days. Whether you choose the just X1C or the AMS kit with it, you will have it very quickly. The second thing that I like about this printer is it's quick and easy to set up. Unboxing and setting up even with the AMS takes under an hour the first time and later when I purchased more it took me under half an hour to get these set up. That includes linking them up to the Bamboo app, getting everything calibrated and ready to print. The third thing that I like is the small footprint of this printer. Having the AMS on top means that everything is really sleek and compact and I'm able to stack more than one machine in a very small space. The fourth thing that I like about this printer is that it's easily expandable. If you would like more than four colors, you just have to get the AMS hub and purchase additional AMS kits and you can expand this up to 16 colors. I have not had the need to use more than four colors, but I think that this is awesome that you can expand them and it also stays very compact. The fifth thing that I like about this printer is actually seems a little bit funny, but how easy it is to swap the filament. Not something I ever thought I would have cared about before, but the fact that it does not run the filament all the way to the hot end, it's super simple to just grab and go as I need colors on different printers. That makes it that much easier to use this printer if I'm just running a quick prototype this is just kind of my go-to printer because it's so easy to get going. This one is definitely my favorite, the camera, the integrated camera on this printer. It's super easy to get time-lapse. It's super easy to check up on things. If you get notifications, you can check on things very quickly. And I like that in the enclosure, you're just focused on the printer. You're not seeing everything going on in the print shop. You're just seeing what's printing. And this leads into the app. I really like the Bamboo Handy app on my phone because not only is it super easy to scroll through and just pick out a new print, you can send it directly from your phone. Even if there's multiple different printer options, you can choose your printer. I can easily select each of my different printers and see what's printing on it or what I might need to get printing next. And it's super easy to scroll through and see all the different time lapses, what I've printed last on the printer. I love that the time lapses have a preview and then you can download them if you do need the download. I really like being able to remotely monitor everything, get these notifications because I do work another job, but also if it's in the evening, if it's at night, there's different times where I'm just not in the print shop all day long. So if I need to go check something, I can, but I don't need to also be hovering over my phone checking it constantly because I do trust that the notifications come through. In a situation like this, there was some stringing on the bed and it caught itself and sent me a notification. I didn't feel like it was going to ruin the print, so I can just click resume. I don't have to check on it hours later and maybe my print's ruined because it's cooled a little bit. I'm able to quickly make those adjustments. And this leads me into Maker World. There are a lot of websites out there where you can get files, but what I love about Bamboo Maker World is that they have been doing colored printing for so long that the quantity of files out there that are already pre-colored is amazing. I don't think I've seen this quantity somewhere else. There are colored prints out on other websites, but they're kind of hard to find. This one, I just clicked in Articulated Cat and I've got over 60 different options to pick from. That is crazy, That and not all of them are gonna be colored, but the amount of them is just so easy to find. I really love this printer, but there are a couple of cons. So the first con is the amount of filament waste. I've showed it before. There's ways to minimize this, but the filament waste is something that you have to deal with. 
And the second thing that I dislike about this printer is that so much is on the back. If you don't run the AMS, your spool holder's on the back, it's kind of hard to load, and the filament waste coming out the chute on the back, I always end up with a mess behind my printer no matter how much I try to organize it. So with all those pros and cons, we have really found this in my print shop to be one of our favorite printers. I have two girls that help me out part time and we all seem to gravitate towards this printer. It's either the one that we'll run the prototype on or it's the first one that we get going in the morning. And in fact, I've actually purchased four more of this same printer because I really like it. Even compared to the A1 Mini, which was the original thing that I purchased, I um, actually received this one first because the A1 Mini was a pre-order, and I just prefer this. I prefer the camera on this. I prefer a lot of different things, even to the other bamboos. So currently, this is one of my favorite printers. Let me know your thoughts. Thanks for watching.